I thought it was incredible that it was a true story. I mean, I hadn't, I hadn't heard anything about it before and um, was quite fascinated with the story of, of Maria and how she could sort of, it seemed like she took on like two governments sort of in a way, you know, and it's this kind of amazing story of, of an individual standing up and, and taking back what's personal to her. And I think that, that to me is what's so resonant about it is that um, these paintings and this history was her family, you know, and it wasn't property, it wasn't um, art that it has value because of history or, or whatever, it, it had value for her because it was part of her life and part of her family. To be in Vienna and to be shooting in these locations and um, you, you get a sense of the history here and, and so it's, I mean, you really don't have to do anything. It's all just there, you know, it's alive in the, in the ground, it's in, alive in the people, it's um, very much present. And uh, yeah, it's, it's an absolute joy and horror to film, you know? You, you sort of, I'm struck constantly by, by the, the images and how visceral they are and how seeing the flags up on the street outside of the Rathaus and it, it's just shocking. This is a very small scene, it probably meant nothing to her, but I got to look in the mirror at Helen and we just smiled at each other and that was literally all it was, but for me it was, you know, getting to look, you know, as, as the character obviously it's sort of this out of, out of time moment, but, but for me as an actor just to get to sit there and, and look at Helen Mirren and, and be present with her, it was, you know, kind of a, a dream. She's so elegant and she's so, um, She's got it, that beautiful, quiet elegance to her, which terrifies me because it means stillness and it means power without saying anything and without moving. And, and she's also got this amazing sense of humor. So, so she's got this incredible you know, dynamic within her. And, and I've always looked up to Helen. I've always, always looked up to her and you know, sort of seen her as the pinnacle of what, what it is to be an actor. Simon from day one has been one of the most wonderful people I've ever worked with because he sets this amazing tone on set where everybody works at their, their peak because he, he makes them their best. You know, he, he lifts everybody up, he's constantly reinforcing positive, he's constantly giving you feedback and, and making you feel, you know, at home and safe and uh, creative and, and everything. So he's yeah, he's been absolutely amazing. And they work, we work so fast and yet, you know, he still keeps positive and doesn't get, you know, panicked in any way. And he has such a passion for the project and such a passion for storytelling and for characters and for um, this sort of enormous narrative of this, of this film and, and really understands the, the personal aspect of it.